Hi guys, I'm Alex. I'm the manager here at Jupiter Shooting Sport. And what we have here is gonna be your Henry Model X Big Boy in 4570. As you can see, the firearm is clear and safe. So I'm gonna start to the front and then to the rear of this firearm. So what we're gonna have here is gonna be your 5 8 by 24 pitch threaded barrel. So it is suppressor ready. We're also gonna have a loading tube. We're also gonna have here some tough synthetic furniture. It's gonna be very lightweight, worry-free. This stuff is very rugged, hard to scratch, and can take a hell of a beating. They have added a little Picatinny rail here at the bottom for whatever attachments it is that you would like to put here, a light, all kinds of other things, even a bipod. Um, they also have two little M-lock slots on both sides of the firearm, and they're gonna have a little swivel here for your sling as well as another attachment here. They did have a very generous fiber optic front sight. They, are gonna, they went with the green in the front and orange in the rear. This is very bright, easy to pick up for uh, fast target acquisition. You do have an option to mount any Picatinny rail or something up here if you would like to also add an optic later down the road. Like I said, this guy here is chambered in 4570. And what this is pretty cool is not only do they have this loading tube here, but you also have a loading side gate as well. This is honestly, I have this rifle, I love this rifle. It's a banger and I love using the side gate. That's just me. They didn't go with too big of a loop. It's a pretty standard, pretty nice loop. I prefer this one, but a lot of people do end up upgrading it to a big, some of the Ranger Point Precision gear and stuff like that. I'd like to keep mine pretty simple. Um, they do have a very generous butt stock here, pretty cushioned and padded like I said, this guy is a banger. If you have shot these 4570s, then you know. Other than that, these are pretty much all the features for this guy. Another reason why I like the 4570 is it's America's very first, I think, um, long distance round. I know back in the day when they used to actually shoot this at long distances, they actually used to aim high and lob it. Now for hunting, as far as like pigs, coyote, I mean, this thing pretty much a hog hammer, puts anything down in one shot. And to be honest with you, with the right load, 4570 can pretty much take anything that walks this planet. I love Henry repeating arms. They are made right here in the good old USA. So that's always a big plus. But as far as this gun, very simple, very nice. Also very unique, very modern, but they still kept it classic. Gotta love it. That's pretty much all I have for you guys with this firearm here. Please remember to like, comment, and subscribe at the bottom. And let us know what you thought about this video and what you guys would like to see in the future. Thanks.